Hello everyone, Cap here and welcome back to some more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor. Let us go for a full beam build. Well, not full because I'm starting with the Thunderhead. But I would like to get the Arms Core Coil Gun as my second weapon and kind of focus on that. Because it is awesome. I really enjoy playing with it. It's very strong and also very fun. Especially if you also get the Mining Overclock. Kind of cool usually and if you get more beam weapons and i can get more beam weapons with this guy uh, because there are the flame thrower the breach cutter and the shard defractor i believe uh, those are all heavy weapons and also beam weapons um, if you get those, if you get two beam weapons, you can get the beam weapon upgrades, like longer range and lifetime and all that stuff. And that makes the arms core coil gun insane. And not only damage wise, but also fun wise. <laughs> so I want to go for that. Let's get the arms core coil gun second. I don't have a ton of money to reroll. Can I get... is there more gold? There's more gold. Let's get that. Maybe need another reroll. Do we have enough? Oh my god, we only have one reroll. We are 20, 29 gold. Uh, never lucky. Okay. That's okay. I will restart and I will be back with Arms Core Coil Gun as my second weapon. Alright, next run. Already here, and I didn't even need to reroll. So here we are. Arms core coil gun. Do the beam that pieces terrain and leaves a damaging trail. Let's go. Also, it is kinetic damage, so we will also be able to get kinetic damage upgrades since the Thunderhead is also kinetic damage. Arms core coil gun. Oh, fire rate doesn't do anything on this thing. I guess we gotta pick pick Nitra. It's the only choice here, really. Uh, this is not that good. And yeah, we go with this. Just more damage on Nitra. Also a little bit slower, of course. We don't have a big amount of Nitra yet, though. Doesn't really matter too much. Hey, there's kinetic damage up. Get that. We want some crit as well. The damage over time on the arms core coil gun can also crit. So the lingering effect. this uh, The numbers that are popping up here right now. Those can crit. Okay, let's make sure we get all the gold. Well, I say gold and I mean XP, of course. This, more crits. Uh, I will pick up that magnet once we are done here. Let's farm some more XP. Fine, let's get this to six and piercing shots. Best overclock. Can we get some more enemies? Man, gotta take this. Wanted it, uh, the level on the coil gun, but cannot ignore that. Legendary crit damage. Don't want to kill the bosses too quickly, but one of them is dead here in a second. Also, I do not want these. I mean, I could get this, but I really want this.
Okay. Uh, we need beam weapons. None of these. There's one. Let's get the shot diffractor. And now we get beam upgrades, potentially. This one. Beam damage. Beam range. Beam lifetime, I think. Other ones. Okay, let's get 10 luck. Ooh, ooh, double level or 30%? Nah, beam lifetime is too good, especially on the coil gun. That just means the damaging effect that lingers around gets damage for longer, so it just increases the damage overall quite significantly. Beam damage. Yeah, the arms core coil gun will be ridiculous. Let's see if we can also get... What is all of this, man? Fine, one, one HP. Uh, let's see if we can also get mining, maybe, on that arms core coil gun. That's also very fun, cleaning out the map with it. Also, with a bit more luck here, maybe we can get a legendary weapon upgrade on that coil gun for another beam. That would be insane as well. I don't want any of these. Actually, pickup radius is good. And then... Wait, I'm poor. I don't have anything. Uh, I don't want this. I save. It's alright. Let's continue. We've got work to do and quotas to meet. You have your objectives. Ready for a fear when this is over. Mushroom quest. Classic. Man, can't wait for the day when they, I don't know, <laughs> maybe <laughs> change or reduce the amount of mushrooms needed to f uh, finish this quest. That would be nice. More luck. I want more beam upgrades. More legendary beam upgrades. Well, more we legendary weapon upgrade on the arms core coil gun, which can give an additional uh, beam. I'm pretty sure. Move speed. Okay, here we go. Final beam weapon. Why not? Actually, I don't really need another beam weapon. I already have two, so I get the beam upgrades. But I guess might as well go for another beam. Get all of this. Uh, trigger! Oh my god. <laughs> so stupid. I uh, couldn't quite get it. Also, kinetic damage is insane, but fine, let's get reload. I will come back for that drop. Let us finish the mushrooms and also there's a lot of XP up here. More pickup radius. Actually, I think. Having a hard time picking up everything. Damage. Uh, 
Beam lifetime. Yeah, I just focus on beam upgrades and coil gun now, I think, as much as I can, really. Coil gun. Definitely need the coil gun levels, though. Most importantly. Okay, let's get the... This here. And... Oh my god, we get both the insane. I want both. Uh, but let's get an additional beam first. Get the drop without killing the bosses. Plasma damage. Oh. Actually, I'm not taking this. <laughs> I don't care about plasma damage. I want the coil gun to be the uh, main attraction here. And let's get weapon range. Weapon range is very good. And I guess we go... Well, we could get the clipboard of grudges with the magma map here. Stand on the lava. lava. Uh, I don't want to stand around too much though. I want to collect resources. So I will pick uh, go to bullets instead. I uh, still didn't fish finish the mushrooms. Also, there's more to mine here. The mushroom. Get that stuff. Okay, boss is dead in a second. Oil gun. Okay, there's one more mushroom to the right. Beam lifetime. So many beam upgrades. Okay, got it. I actually want more movement speed as well. With the arms core coil gun in particular, it's kind of nice if you can circle around and clump up all the bugs. And then you just run circles around them and shoot in the middle with the coil gun and deal damage over time. And in that entire area. Very nicely. Kinetic damage. So for the coil gun. Would get double double level. Want these to 6? I don't really care that much to be honest. I really don't. I kind of could ignore these altogether now. Let's reroll. Double level on this. Very good. More XP. Sure. Reroll. Hey, triple level. Hey, this, this is perfect. Also, hey, we could either go for full damage, but I mean, I think this is better if you just want to be insane and kill everything, of course. But mining, though, mining is fun. Mining is always fun. Just deleting the map with this, especially if I have insane reload and shoot all the time and range and lifetime and all that. So all the walls will just disappear. And also if I get more beams, that's yeah, that's going to be very fun. More of this. Also we might get a gold scanner or something. Gold scanner would be insane here with the gold tip bullets. Let's go. You know the drill, miner. Fulfill your objectives. Let's get out of here. Man. Mushrooms again. Have so much nitra right away here. Also, I should probably also level this um, as a secondary objective, kind of. Would use the help of that damage to finish up enemies and especially bosses, I guess. Oh, those really hurt. Those green shots. The 
So many loot packs over here. Can I get there? Not really. Let's get out of here. Still lucky day loot packs. Can't really mine you right now. Also, let's get to the drop. Try and clean that out. Ooh. I actually picked the epic reload. Don't really have reload yet. Oh, got a magnet. Uh, there's an XP scanner. Uh, none, none of these items are insane, but XP scanner since I have mining. Sounds fun. It's... Um, I really don't want to level these. Get, just get crit. And get this. Beam reload. Coil gun. Double coil gun. Okay, one more level. And we are... Fully overclocked on that one. Wait, we are so far off finishing that stupid mushroom quest. Man, I hate it so much. Not even worth finishing. Also, yeah, I'm not finishing it, I think. I'm so slow. And I don't have time, probably. Let's just focus on collecting XP. Beam weapon range. Look at this. Nice beams cleaning out the walls. Okay, bosses are going down here in a sec. Um, yes, HP, I guess. Hey, here we go. And plus three beams, of course. Uh, where are we going? Down there. Oh, we're already here. Mine. Mine everything. Alright, another level, and more damage on this, sure. Plenty more where that came from. Stage four is waiting for you, miner. Or reload on this. Or I guess. Or reroll. We could get a better upgrade. I have some extra luck. Armor, nah. Let's reroll here. Let me try again. Fine, let's get this. More fire rate. Beam lifetime. And reroll. And uh, this here, for sure. And also this. Yep, very good. Okay. Ah, not slow anymore. It's good. Spending all the nitro. Look at the beams. They are already so big. And you don't even see how long they last. Um, the animation fades away very quickly, but it does deal damage for way longer then you can see the visual.
Look at everything taking damage behind me. Look at all those numbers popping up. Oil gun going crazy. Fine, let's get some armor. Ooh, more epic reload. Faster and more coil gun shots. Just finish this for now. Oil gun. Yeah, damage already kind of high. Hmm. I guess more damage and everything. Sure. Uh, I want to go up there to collect everything, but maybe we go down here first. See if there's some more to mine. Even more reload, maybe. Hey, there's a magnet. Very good. I will pick that at some point. Let's first see if there is more to mine. Yeah, it's okay. Let's get all of this. Okay, get out of here, though. Bosses are about to die, and I definitely want to get to the magnet before they do. Oh well, by the time they do, end of. This is nice and all, but kinetic damage. Pump up the coil gun even more. Mm, wait, can I get through here? Can you shoot in that direction? Got it. Mm. Beam damage. This one. All right. Also level 57, not bad. Gather up your beard and get onto that drop pod. It's about to leave. Chill here for a second. Congratulations, miner, on completing the four easy steps. Next up is the final stage. Reroll. Gonna roll the dice on this one. Okay, let's finish this one. We don't see these overclock, rock and stone. More reroll. Actually, I do have gold to bullets. I do. I reroll one more time if I see some insane beam upgrade or something. Show me more. Well, that's not quite it. Uh, actually, this is good enough. I pick this, and now we're done. Though I'm not rerolling anymore. Keeping the rest for gold to bullets. Walls just getting disintegrated. Once the coil gun actually shoots in the correct direction, that is. It always tries to aim at the enemies. To so kind of want to try and get a wall in between you and the enemies. So, yeah, that the mining actually happens properly. Also, let's mine this entire map. Mining the final stage, always cool. Also actually helpful, because you will have more space to 
Dodge the boss. Even faster. Look at this. <laughs> when it targets, it does look pretty funny. All the walls just disappear. Nitra. Okay, let's get to the uh, drop. We are kind of slow, but I think we are fine. Actually, minus 17. Hmm. We will see. This is a bit late. I'm not picking this. Uh, this is also not good though. Wait. <laughs> I guess it's actually <laughs> the stupid belt here. I could get the gold scanner, but there's nothing left really. Let's just get the belt. And pick up more XP for the boss. Ooh. Beam lifetime. Alright. The belt also triggers from the lava. It's actually very bad on this map. <laughs> Randomly triggering it without any doing anything. It's already not insane when it triggers in good situations. Right, let's maybe mine this little piece here and then get the boss. Then where are you going? Okay. Yep, boss is taking quite a bit of damage. Though the boss damage is mainly the auto cannon, I'm pretty sure. But the coil gun is cleaning up everything else, and we are already done. Easy. Yeah, this is one of my favorite builds. This guy with uh, auto cannon is just super strong, but also the coil gun is so fun. Look at this. And the damage over time all over the place. And if you can get mining as well on top of that, even more fun. And yeah, not only fun, just super strong as well. You can easily clear Hazard 5 with this. Let's get out of here. Let's see the damage on the two weapons. And... Yep. <laughs> also, this run was super short. Only 20 minutes. Uh, that's very fast. And arms core coil gun, 48k DPS. And Thunderhead, only 10k. But yeah, Thunderhead did definitely kill the boss, I'm pretty sure. And arms core coil gun just killed everything else. This is pretty cool. Yeah, I, I enjoy this build a lot. These, the arms core coil gun is just super fun. All right, GG's. Thank you guys for watching, hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Take care, bye.